This is a Rotke Mods video. Hello, I'm Greg Rotke of Rotke Mods, and welcome to episode 29 of my Mac Pro series. In this episode, I will be going over why your Mac Pro 1 comma 1 slash 2 comma 1 may be crashing in El Capitan. The main reason is more than likely your RAM. Now this problem has been an issue for quite some time from what I can tell. In at least El Capitan, it may also be in earlier ones like Yosemite. I don't really know because I've never ran Yosemite on this Mac Pro. But when I first got this Mac Pro, it came with a bunch of 512 megabyte DIMMs and 1 gigabyte DIMMs with only one set of 2 gigabyte DIMMs. And I had problems with it crashing, which I eventually found out was just my memory controller. I never had another reason to question it past that. Well, when I was deciding to upgrade more RAM to go to the 8 gig DIMMs that I eventually figured out was a bad idea, I decided to go back to the original RAM for a while and I kept having crashes again. And I thought it was just bad RAM. Well, to a certain degree it may be, but the main reason is this. Now doing my research online and having a viewer named Ivan, who has helped me with another video in the past, Ivan, who is now also a pretty cool friend, we became friends over this one situation. He messaged me on Facebook over a crashing problem he was having with his system. And I theorized that the RAM may be the problem. And as I was looking through his error reports, which his error report is off to the left right here, I kept noticing the same trends and noticing that I'd seen that error report before. So I started doing background research on this whole situation and apparently 512 meg DIMMs don't seem to work at all. Most Mac Pro 1 comma 1, 2 comma 1s came with sets of 512 meg DIMMs and usually were either configured with 1 or 2 gigabytes worth of RAM. Now unless you haven't upgraded your RAM since then you may not be having these problems. Also, at least two gigabytes is the minimum for running Lion to begin with. So if you have a 512 meg DIMM, you should replace them. This system came with Hynex 512 meg RAM. In fact, this had all the original RAM that was in it, originally configured with two gigs. It came with four 512 meg Hynex RAM DIMMs. So if you're having this problem, it's probably your RAM. For some reason, El Capitan does not like 512 megabyte DIMMs, nor does it seem to like 1 gigabyte DIMMs. Now, there has been conflicting reports online that 1 gigabyte DIMMs may work, but some of them just are worn out and damaged or whatnot. Well, I don't know if that's quite true. In my experience, and in Ivan's experience, we both figured out that one gigabyte DIMMs are just as buggy as 512 megabyte. So if you're having problems with your Mac Pro crashing when you get into El Capitan, crashing when opening an app, for instance, and you happen to have one gigabyte or 512 megabyte DIMMs in your system, remove them. Upgrade if you don't have any more. I even upgraded to eight gigabytes worth of two gigabyte DIMMs and he has not had the problem since. And as I would recommend, go with either a two or a four gigabyte DIMM and avoid the eight gigabyte like I've addressed in earlier episodes like episode 23. Also, I want to go over what panic report you may receive. If you have something like this right here and it says CPU caller and gives a CPU number, either zero or one, usually. This probably isn't your CPU if you have the one gigabyte or five, 12 megabyte RAM modules. And the best way to figure out what you have is to go and check your system information and go to memory and just see if you have any ones that say one gigabyte or five, 12 megabyte. And that's all you have to do. Once you replace those modules, you in theory should be fine. Of course, this is just from basic research and 
us testing these things to figure this out. Anyway, thank you again, Ivan, for helping figure all this stuff out. I'm glad that we managed to work together to do this and figure out all this stuff. I'm glad your Mac is now working great, and I'm glad that we as a YouTube community can come together and figure things like this out without much issues. And I got an interesting and quite cool friend out of the whole situation. So once again, if you're having problems with El Capitan crashing and it's giving out errors, for instance, like CPU caller, it may be other ones, but usually involves the CPU. Check your RAM. See if you have 512 megabyte DIMMs or even 1 gigabyte DIMMs. And if you do, replace them. Anyway, thank you for watching. This has been a Rutke Mods video.